In today's video, we're going to take a look at the differences and similarities between two popular breeds, the German Shorthaired Pointer and the German Shepherd Dog. While most people would consider these breeds quite different, they share more than just a country of origin. So stick around and you'll find out if these breeds really are as different as you think. Welcome back to the German Short Head Pointer Show. If you are new here, my name's Will. I'm a canine behaviorist and I'm the founder and CEO of FemreaCanineLeaders.com. Now, this channel is dedicated to you learning everything that you could dream of knowing about the incredible German Short Head Pointer, then how to become a high level canine leader that can raise perfect German Short Head Pointer companions. So, if you love the GSP as much as we do here at Femrea, start your journey by hitting that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so that you never miss a future German Short Head Pointer to video. So let's dive into today's video and we're going to be taking a look at the key differences and similarities between these two gorgeous German breeds. Now the German Shorthead Pointer was bred and developed in, well you guessed it, Germany. They were bred to not only retrieve down fowl for hunters but to also track mammals like deer on land. At the end of the day the sleek German Shorthead Pointer went home with its hunter and then resumed its role as a loving member of the family. Now the German Shepherd Dog was also bred and developed in Germany but with a a different role in mind. The German Shepherd was originally bred to protect farms and herds of sheep. They originally were not thought of as companions or brought into the house and stayed with the livestock all of the time. Now that being said, they have excelled off of the farm and in the home full time in more recent years. Hey guys, very quickly, I just wanted to interrupt and let you know about our boot camp program if you've never heard of it before. It's the program that as a canine behaviorist, I use every single day with all of the clients and all of the bad behavior cases that I work with to high levels of success. It is focused on teaching you how to become a high level canine leader that is able to restructure the relationship with your dog so that they see you as that leader and they know to look up to you for guidance and direction. When we achieve that, we can then finally address those bad behavior problems and get to the point of having the perfect canine companion that you've always dreamed of. So if you want more information about our bootcamp program, the link will be down in the description box below. But until then, let's get back to the video you were just watching. Both the German Shorthead Pointer and the German Shepherd are high energy working breeds that love to have a job. The Pointer excels at tracking and literally pointing out game for hunters as well as retrieving down fowl from watery areas thanks to that water repellent double coat. Because of their energy levels they are prone to escaping the yard and will wander wherever those nose take them. Now the German Shepherd is similar in that it is extraordinarily gifted scent dog like the Pointer but tends to stay more more close to home as it is a guardian breed. German Shepherds are well known for their police and military work and they've done both protection and scent detection dogs as well as being service dogs to people with disabilities for example. Now German Shorthaired Pointers were bred to work independently and away from the, number, the hunter as it attracts and retrieves game. They are highly intelligent and will make decisions for themselves. That being said, they are extremely willing to please but can be bored easily and become stubborn if not given the proper levels of mental stimulation. The German Shepherd is also very eager to please and intelligent but will not become stubborn or willful out of boredom so much so that it will if they don't see you as their calm consistent canine leader. The German Shorthaired Pointer is 20 to 30 pounds smaller than the German Shepherd who weighs in between 45 and 70 pounds depending on male or female with males as always usually being a bit larger. They have a very dense undercoat and a sleek water repellent outer coat along with webbed feet that makes them excellent swimmers. For a double coated breed they have some of the most minimal grooming requirements out there. We see the biggest contrast between the breeds in their coat and grooming requirements since the German Shepherd is known for its very long dense fluffy coat and undercoat. The German Shepherd will require brushing daily and quite a bit of care in the grooming department especially compared to a German Shorthaired Pointer. They are also bigger and range from 75 to 95 pounds and of course the bigger the dog the more fur they have to shed all over your home. The Pointer is a rambunctious and energetic breed so they do best with older children that they aren't as likely to knock over by accident. 
They are a loving and loyal family dog, but do tend to bond more closely to the person that works with them most often. They are a decent watchdog because they are wary of strangers, but they are typically not unfriendly with them. The German Shepherd, on the other hand, is good with all children, and once they mature, have a good sense of when they need to be gentle. The German Shepherd is very protective and known for its excellent guardian and protection instincts that it will not hesitate to display if it thinks that you or your loved ones are in danger. Now the pointer likes to be around its family, like most canines, and though it is an independent thinker because of its original purpose, they can be more prone to separation anxiety. The German Shepherd is similar in that they tend to bond closely with one person, but they are affectionate with the whole family. Both breeds are loyal and steadfast companions who will generally look to you for guidance and direction, which if you can tap into, is a starting point to having an incredibly obedient dog. Now, depending on your lifestyle, you may find that the German Shorthaired Pointer or the German Shepherd fit better into your home. The biggest differences between the breeds being the grooming requirements and those guarding instincts. For an experienced owner that wants a highly trainable dog with low grooming requirements, then the German Shorthaired Pointer could be a fantastic opportunity. If you're happy with the higher levels of grooming requirement and want more protection and guarding instincts, then maybe look at the German Shepherd. Now, I hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, please make sure you hit that like button get involved down in the comment section let us know if you think that we missed any key differences that should be highlighted about these two incredible breeds and remember we have two dedicated german short haired pointer videos coming here to this channel every single week so don't forget to subscribe because i can't wait to see you on the next episode of the femre german short haired pointer show